finally, 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 people are now seeing the true side of Mr. Beast. And in my opinion, it's about time. You always see him being praised, don't you? So many people think he's a good guy and it knocks me sick. But Mr. Beast has finally shown his true colors. So much so that the entire Twitter world is against him. And you might be thinking, what has Mr. Beast done that is so bad to make the whole world go against him suddenly? And I'll tell you, he uh, bought 20,000 kids in South Africa a pair of shoes. It's disgusting, all right? He should be jailed. Now, in case you can't detect very obvious sarcasm, I think this situation is a load of shite. But before we get any further, I am trying to hit 400,000 subscribers on this channel, and we're getting very, very close. We're near, like, the final countdown at this point, so if you want to help out, please hit the subscribe button. You'll make me very, very happy. And we will get to Mr. Beast's new video on the outrage, but first of all, let's see why people were already annoyed at Mr. Beast this week. So he actually posted a tweet about a week ago saying, I need your help. Next time you see Feastable in Walmart and soon to be new retailers, if you could clean up the presentation and make it look better, that'd make me very happy. I'm building a team to do this routinely, just needs help in the short term. Seems like a very innocent tweet, doesn't it? Well, apparently it doesn't to everyone. Mr. Beast getting his obsessed parasocial child labor fans to face up his products in Walmart is absolutely unhinged. Is it really though? Like, I don't know if this is a hot take, but... Something tells me you're overreacting. Now, the amount of people who tried comparing this to child labor is genuinely insane. Like, Mr. Beast posted a tweet saying, by the way, if you just so happen to be in a Walmart and you do walk past my chocolate bars and they are a bit of a mess, if you want, you could put them up so the presentation's better. That'd be great. But no, apparently to Twitter, that is absolutely disgusting behavior and he must be punished. So at this point, it was already one of them weeks where Twitter just hated Mr. Beast and they've been hating on him for a long time now, which is obviously a bit mental because all he does is help people. But then after Mr. Beast received so much backlash, he didn't stay on his best behavior. He wasn't trying to avoid the scandals. If anything, he tried to anger people more. And the way he did this was he gave 20,000 kids in South Africa shoes because they didn't have shoes before and it was affecting their education because they couldn't walk to school, which in my opinion, is a disgusting thing to do. Literally one of the nicest things he could have done. I've never done anything that nice. He makes me feel like an awful person. But people were still fuming. And I mean, let's just take a look at some of these stupid tweets. People praising things like this, like good guy Mr. Beast, ignore the reality that he makes a profit from these type of videos. This isn't really charity. Now this is a form of criticism that people have been giving Mr. Beast recently. They say that he only does these nice things because he gains a profit, which is already a very stupid way to criticize him because if he wasn't making profit from these videos, he wouldn't be able to spend more money helping people. Secondly, it's became pretty obvious that Mr. Beast doesn't really make much of a profit on any of these main channel videos because he spends so much money on them and he has to use his other channels to fund the main channel videos. At the end of the day, he's spending millions and millions and millions of dollars every single year helping people who could benefit from it. And if you have a problem with that, I'm sorry, you're a fucking idiot. If you're mad at the fact that a YouTuber has to make these differences and we live in a world where we're having to rely on some just e-celebrity to try and do this, then fair enough. You have every right to be annoyed. Mr. Beast shouldn't be the person who has to help these people. Like, for example, the video where he took a thousand people who are blind and give them a surgery that would help them see. He shouldn't have to be the person who does that. That should be a given. Like, the fact that these people can't get this surgery for free, even though, as it was said in the video, that 50% of the people who are blind could see with this surgery, it's mental. So if you want to be annoyed at that, then fair enough. But if you're annoyed at Mr. Beast for making money from these videos so you can help more people in the world, I just don't get it. And by the way, everything I just said is completely irrelevant when you bear in mind the fact that this was uploaded to Mr. Beast's philanthropy channel, where he literally doesn't make a single bit of profit from these videos. It's a philanthropy channel. It's a charity channel where all the money goes back to helping people. He didn't make anything. And he gave 20,000 kids shoes that they didn't have already. And when you hear the reasons why these shoes could be so important to them, I just don't get how you could be annoyed. For hundreds of thousands of kids in South Africa, the only thing standing between them and an education is a simple pair of shoes. Let me explain. Because of the extreme poverty in rural towns, walking to school barefoot is the only option, which means they have to walk for miles over harsh terrain, broken glass, and contaminated water. The word got out quickly, and according to the teachers, the schools were more packed than they've ever been, with school kids eager to get a pair of shoes. So Darren and the team had to work extra hard to ensure that every single kid got their own pair of shoes. Uh, so not only did Mr. Beast give these kids a pair of shoes, 
he also made it easier for them to get an education. The monster. Now, Mr. Beast actually responded to that tweet we just read out that was criticizing him for like this video. And Mr. Beast just said, look, it's on a philanthropy channel, it's a charity channel, I don't make any money. And this guy who made the original tweet just shows how stupid he truly is. If it was really out of the goodness of your heart, you wouldn't be turning it to content. Oh, Jesus Christ, yeah. Um, we're working with a lack of brain cells to say the least. How do you think he has the money to help people? The whole point of the channel is so he can create videos that create revenue that he can then use to help the charity. Like, use your brain. And I simply don't believe that you don't profit from the videos that get 100 million views. Don't take people for fools. So now he's just saying massive claims without any proof. He's saying that Mr. Beast is lying about charity. Right, um... Could we get some evidence, please? <laughs> it would be really nice if the Mr. Beast fans could grow a brain and realize that their hero is basically just producing struggle porn at this point. His acts of kindness don't solve any of the underlying issues that cause the problems. He's very temporarily solving. And they also followed that tweet up by saying, like, those kids in Africa don't need Nike shoes. They need not to have to walk miles every day just to do their daily tasks because there's no permanent infrastructure in their village to fill their needs. Like, yes, I get it. There's clear a lot of problems in the world. Mr. Beast hasn't solved every single issue in the world and he never will, quite frankly. But don't have a go at him for trying to solve one of them. At the end of the day, he's one guy and yes, he's very, very, very rich, but he does a lot more than most people in his position to try and help people. He was told by people in South Africa that one of the things that is stopping kids from getting an education is the fact that they don't have a pair of shoes and they can't walk miles to get to school every day. So he'd give them shoes. 20,000 of them, by the way. And the teachers literally said they haven't seen the school so busy. Like, how are you hating on this? I don't understand. You know what? This next tweet is my personal favorite. And it's a reply to a tweet that is showing a clip from Mr. Beast's video in South Africa. And it just says, let me know when y'all catch up and realize how weird this motherfucker is. Why then? <laughs> God, Mr. Beast using his money to give kids shoes in South Africa so they can get an education? How weird is this motherfucker? You know, I actually saw this parody news article that really does put into perspective what people actually see on Twitter when Mr. Beast does something good. Mr. Beast reblinds a thousand people. Today is awesome because starting right now, we're going to find hundreds of formerly blind people, stab them in the eyes and destroy the vision that we just restored before proceeding to put on scrubs, hide in a waiting room and surprise each patient by jumping out immediately driving a stake into their optic nerve and then joyfully hugging them as they wept in disbelief. Like genuinely, this is what people on Twitter see. Like there is nothing more confusing to me than the outrage that people seem to have against Mr. Beast, who genuinely does more good than pretty much anyone on the YouTube platform and for some reason he's one of the most hated. Obviously in the grand scheme of things it's a minority of people but because Mr. Beast is so big that minority is still like thousands upon thousands upon thousands of people who are very vocal about it and it just it's so weird. Like, what are you doing with your lives? But yeah, either way, let me know your opinion. Do you think Mr. Beast should be locked up? I think it's probably the only way he's gonna learn. But maybe you have a different opinion. And if you do, let me know in the comment section down below. And I'm gonna leave the video there. So if you did enjoy, please do a like down below. Subscribe if you are new. And until the next one, I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, goodbye. <laughs>